that I am very sorry and I apologize for the inconvenience of me not giving up. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Pentuf here today for a new and another one great opening video. And the sole purpose of this video is to tell you not to gamble, especially on those camo crates or whatever it's called. I literally don't have a clue why Wargaming did that and put those one in crates. There is literally no reasons to do that as... I mean, it's only a camo. Uh, why should you care about a camouflage, you know? But just for those of you who are thinking... Hey, is it worth it? Uh, do I have a chance to get the, the new animated radioactive glow epic camouflage? Wow, for a drop chance of only 2%, guys, 2%. I thought, yeah, you know what? I'm gonna get myself scammed. I'm gonna sacrifice myself to save the others. That's what you asked in stream yesterday, and that's what we're gonna do today. As you can see, I bought a couple of gold. Don't worry, I'm not gonna spend 60,000 gold on those crates. I'm gonna buy two offers, this one and this one, and we're gonna open it and see what we get. So here we go, we purchased the first one. Ah, oh, gosh, it hurts. Buying camos, it hurts, because even if I have the animated Radio Glow Epic thing, I'm not gonna use it. So here, I'm literally throwing my money at Wargaming for no freaking reason. But at least, if it helps some people not to get scammed by not buying those crates, I would consider it was worth it. So here we go, we have 18 containers to open. Are we gonna get the radioactive glow camouflage? I'm not gonna lie to you, even if we get this camo, I will still be deceived because I don't freaking care. I don't freaking care, but let's go. Here we go, we open the first one. Pum, 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 pum. Uh, certificate for the salvage scrap. What does it look like, by the way? Real quick, I just want to see what it looks like. Uh, can I can I put it on whatever tank I want, at least for the price? Uh, where is it? Uh, where is it? That's this one? No, that's not this one. God damn it! Where is it? I'm. I want to. I want to see what it looks like. Where is it? Uh, no Vesuvio, no, oh, man, I have way too many camouflages, that's some big bullshit, where is, ah, it's here, so, uh, okay, it's for tier 3 and tier 4, okay, let's go to a tier 3 vehicle, just because I want to see what this one looks like, so let's put it on the cruiser, for example, just to see what happens, ah, that's an epic camouflage, alright, uh, looks cool, actually looks cool, I like it, I kind of like it, even if I'm never going to use it, but still, I kind of like it, Okay, so it seems like with those uh, camos, you can get epic, uh, with the, those crates, sorry, you can get epic can, uh, epic camouflages, but the, the drop rate can go from tier 1 to tier 10, so if you're lucky, you will get them on tier 10, if you're not lucky, you're gonna get them on tier 3, like it was my case. So here we go, again. Let's see what we're gonna get. Yay, the same, the exact same thing. <laughs> At least I get some free experience with it. Ah, come on, nice. Three times in a row, the three exact same camouflages. Let's go again, the same camouflage, and here we go, the same. Oh, man, the pain, the pain. Why would someone... Uh, ah, that's the animated one, radioactive ca glow camouflage. We, s we managed to get it, yay. L look at how IP I am to get this camo. Uh, where is it? I want to find it. Okay, where does it go? Tier 5 vehicle. I'm just gonna see how it performs real quick on uh, whatever. Let's go for the Churchill. Let's see how the, the glow camo looks like. Does it really glows? Wow! So 2% just for, to have something shiny. Wow. Incredible, isn't it? Incredible. Ah, oh, god damn it, really. Are there really people spending that much money on it? Uh, I'm gonna see after during a battle if uh, if it's animated while playing or not, just for you to know. Alright, so here we go. Uh, one and, and another one, Radioactive Glow. Nice. Uh, what do we have? Uh, shitty things. Shitty things. Shitty things. Ah, no, radioactive. Sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. It seems like it's easy to get the radioactive glow camouflage because as a... S oh, oh, burning mad. What is this? Burning mad. I like it. Burning mad. What does it look like? I want to see. I, I need to show you all the camouflages so you know what it looks like. Okay, tier 3 vehicle. Tier 3 or tier 4. Let's see what we can do at tier 4. What does it look like? Uh, kind of like it. Kind of like it as well. 
even if uh, it doesn't feel like it's something you would see on World of Tank Blitz, but much more on Call of Duty or something like that, it's still a cool one. All right, all right, all right, all right. Let's continue our scam. Where are my containers? Here they are. Come on, come on. What do we get? Uh, the same burning mat thing. Come on. I wish I could get the, the radioactive one on uh, maybe the tier 10s or something. Oh my gosh, it's painful. It's really painful. I spent, uh, how many? Not that much gold, 8.4k. So I'm fine with this as I still have a lot of golds running by, but god damn it, look at this. Okay, we still got a couple of radioactive glow camouflages. Are we gonna get one last in the two crates that are still about to be opened? Uh, no. And, uh, come on. Okay, we got a lot of times the salvage crap one. Uh, okay, we have different camos because I'm expecting them to be on different tanks. Okay, tier 7, tier 8, tier 9, tier 10, uh, tier 3, tier 4, tier 1, tier 2, tier... Th uh, okay, tier 4, tier 10. Uh, oh, we got a radioactive glow on tier 10. Nice, very nice. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna try it just to see how it goes. Can we see it in battle? Uh, I'm not gonna go for a battle, I'm just gonna go into the, the training room just to see. Uh, I just need to find a tank that doesn't have any legendary camo, for example, WZ. Alright, let's equip it just to see how it performs. Radioactive glow. Um, yeah, let's go. Let's see how it goes. Okay, I'm gonna have to replace it on pretty much everything. Uh, I don't like it, it looks ugly. That's only my opinion. Okay, so it's uh, animated in the garage, but is it animated into the battle? Let's see, boys. Let's create a room real quick. Ready, battle. Uh, I hope that for the price, it's actually animated in battle. But I'm expecting it not to be animated, simply because even if you have the device to be able to run the, can the animated camos, uh, when it comes to older devices, it's gonna be a struggle. Uh, okay, it's actually glowing. Is it glowing for the whole battle or not? If it's glowing for the whole battle, I would be impressed. Uh, yeah, it's actually... Okay, it's animated even when you are playing. That's nice. That's very, very nice. I was literally not expecting Wargaming to put something like that in the game. Uh, but yeah, it seems like... Uh, that's good, at least. But I, I think they put the glow camouflage into the, the game just because... Uh, in crates, sorry, just because if all people could buy them, it would be a nightmare for older device to run the game, especially in uh, in the new battle mode, etc. Because uh, you need to load a lot of data, especially with the animated camo. But uh, yeah, looks cool. Looks cool. Looks cool. I don't really like the camo overall, but the fact that it's animated makes it. Uh, it has something special, in my opinion. So yeah, pretty much, that's it for this video, I know you asked for it, you might, don't care, maybe you care, who knows, but that's pretty much what you can expect from these containers. If by now you didn't understand that it's definitely not worth it spending that much gold just to get a shiny camouflage in battle, then there is nothing I can do for you. I hope you enjoyed that game, uh, that game, that crate opening, sorry. If it's the case, feel free to subscribe, like and share, and I'm gonna see you soon at 6pm today for a new Halloween leaks you are really gonna love. See ya guys.